and until you know certain strong people certain strong messages come around and they favor enlightenment more than any other uh, comfort of life such as like you know uh, gambling uh, what was going on in those ancient times you know things of that nature you know uh, unfaithfulness you know you knew when you were young not to kill your mom so you're already self-righteous in a way you know what I mean you knew these things without being told you knew not to kill the ant you know I mean until you learned how to kill the ant and your friend laughed at the ant wiggling and now you kind of like condition yourself to justify killing ants well back in nature's time you know, people were more tuned into nature, so they were enlightened. They fasted in a healthy manner. For what? Why would they fast? Because they were addicted to this natural high of soberness. You know, um, soberness brought them to all the answers they needed, whether they're in the hands of bondage or whether they were free to go about their business or leisurely fishing or whatever their activity may be. But diet, fasting, and being selfless was already high, contribution, high con contributions toward being enlightened, enlightened being. So they had to eliminate writing. They had to eliminate, you know, uh, certain people from thriving with influence. They had to ban and shun these people. Now, how does that reflect now? with the addictions, with the need and the cravings, the oppressors of this world that are the same oppressors from ancient time, the same cycle continues, nothing has changed under the sun. You know, they have persuaded you that this feeling of being drunk, being high, whatever it may be, man, is the way to feel. They marketed it, they've, uh, you know, conditioned the masses and they've sold it on every single street corner legally or illegally. You know what I mean? But that is a temporary feeling. My experience through all this soberness has got me higher and more fulfilled than any other outside substance or absorption. You know what I mean? In my life ever. And then when you give it time, now the divinity rises within you, you know what I mean? Where your values of your inner voice is so loud that your natural high is undeniable. You value being naturally high, I'm not referring to marijuana, naturally high without nothing. Your body changes naturally. Your mindset changes, you know? How can you be selfless if I need alcohol? Or if I need to smoke again, you know what I mean? These are minor distractions for you to be consistent to reach that level of fulfillment. I felt good in that world, but I felt the world where the potential of feeling good is beyond what I ever felt. And that's through being sober, you know what I mean?